some pickings. Business is good, yeah? Yeah, yeah, it's not bad. Hey, um, I better keep going. Hey, Tom, can you just lighten up, please? Yep. Hey, Tom's. Hey, um, take whatever you want. It's on the house. It was one little Christmas party snog. No biggie. Yeah, I know. It's not like I think the romance of the century is about to start. Oh, of course not. And as far as I'm concerned, it's last year's news. But hey, you're cute, but I'm probably more in love with your food than your good looks. Hey. And um, if you want to be friends, I can handle that. Well, I'm glad we cleared that up. So, what are you up to tonight? Hot stuff. Gotcha. It's okay, Mrs. Drysdale. It happens to a lot of people. I would try and put it back in myself, but because you're on our VAP list, I've called in Dr. Thompson. Right, what have we got here? Her IV to show you again. Small veins? I've tried. Okay, if I could just have a wee squiz here. Where's that nice doctor? It's okay. This is Dr. Weston, and he's very good. He knows what he's doing. Okay, you've got a good vein there, Mrs. Drysdale. Oh, hang on. I didn't know you were working on this ward. It's okay. If I'd known, I would have got someone else's. It's okay. What do you want? Man, what kind of profit is that? Look, can I come in? I promise I'll be good. How was your trip up home? Yeah, it was great. I mean, Tahana completely took over with baby. She insisted Tama and I get out, you know, have some time to ourselves. Didn't have to ask us twice, you know, we're off the movies, the beach. So what about you? Have a good time here? Not really. I was mucky mucky. Kept wondering what you were up to. Hey, look, this isn't going to work. If we can't even have a conversation without you getting... I missed you. Drove me up the wall, knowing that you're out there playing happy families. It's not playing, it's for real. Is it? Yes, it is. Look, Shan. I have to put baby down, so if you don't mind. Thank you. Things getting sorted then? Yeah, yeah, the kid's definitely mine. Still processing, eh? No, I'm fine. I'm in celebration mode. Really? Yeah, I'm a free man. Jemima gave me the flick. She's on the next flight back to England. And she's going back to her husband. Carrying your kid. It's got to be some guy. You, um, don't want to be there when the baby's born, watch the first steps, that kind of stuff? Oh, she said she'll send photos. Ever been to England? No. It's a cold place. Dreary. Funny to forgive your kid with a pommy accent. Well, all power to you, Vinny. When Tony was with Matt, you know, Harry had this other dad. I couldn't handle it. You're not going to be there, some stranger bringing up your kid. Yeah, but he'd be an all right guy. Eh? Well, he probably is. He's not you, though, is he? You are going to either love me or hate me. Talk. I want to stay on. Love you, definitely. I don't think so. Oh, well, what's the problem? No paperwork for me, no recruitment drive for you? I think we should keep looking. Eh? I don't need wussy doctors in my department. I need people who I can rely upon, people who are committed. Yeah, yeah, that's me. I love this place. It's why I don't want to leave. No, you don't want to leave because you're passing things up with your girlfriend, I presume. Not exactly. We what happens the next time you have a fight? You going to run away again? No. Yeah, end of the lecture, perhaps? For now. I'm really sorry for making those around, eh? Yes. You would have gone on until he cried, right? You can't let people get away with that kind of rubbish. They walk all over you. Is Mark staying on? Yeah, he is. It was the only decent thing you ever did for Tanya. But you realise it was a bit too much like hard work. Have to find another job. Might not look good on the CV. 
Do you think it's possible for you to consider Tanya's feelings for more than five seconds? And do you think it's possible for you to shut up for more than five seconds? If you have a problem with me staying on here, talk to your sister. What? She told me not to go. You must have got it wrong. Yeah, well, she thought we were professional enough to deal with it. Professional? Mark, she's a blubbering mess whenever you walk past her. Not anymore. It won't work. We just spent ten minutes together fixing a patient's IV line. No sarky comments, no nasty looks. It'll work. Give me a hand with this. The taxi's waiting. Not anymore. What? I told him I wouldn't be long. I gave him ten bucks and sent him on his way. You're going to see me off at the airport? No, you're not going to the airport. And you're not going to England. Jemima, that's my baby. Okay, not Theo's. I want to be a proper father. Not someone he sees every Christmas. I want him to learn Samoan. And I want him to be real, okay? Not living in a castle somewhere where he has no friends. And I want him to learn how to play rugby properly. What if it's a girl? Well, then she needs to learn Samoan and learn how to play netball properly. Yeah, but what about Theo? I've already told him I'm coming home. Well, tell him you made a mistake. I can't keep chopping and changing like this, and neither can you. You really want this baby now? And what about me? Yes, of course. Package deal, right? So romantic. Oh, hey, look, I got a shock, okay? And I was a pig. But I want to be a dad. And I want us to be together. Stay with me. That's what I want more than anything. I'm not going to burn my bridges with Theo. We give it a shot for a couple of weeks and see how we go. I'm in it for the long haul. Okay, if you want to take it slow, it's fine by me. Found it. <laughs> 